Namaste and welcome to a back bending flow. So just taking a moment to land here on your mat. So breathing in through the nose, closing the eyes, rooting through the sit bones. Exhaling through the mouth. Inhaling. Exhaling. And I'm just sitting here in the sunshine today because you take what you can get in the Northern Hemisphere, for sure. I hope the sun is shining with you today. Taking this time to breathe down, surrendering in, dropping the shoulders away from the ears, spine straight. And we're gonna be engaging with a heart opening back bends, so we're going to be breathing some love into our bodies. These heart openers are like a little bit of self-love, right? That we all deserve. Opening our hearts to receive the love, whether that's simply from ourselves, just a little more. So breathing in, down into the belly, Exhaling. And now breathing in through the heart space. Down into the belly, exhaling. I want you to imagine that there's this pink light within your heart space. And as you breathe into the pink light, it glows a little more. And exhaling, surrendering to the love, inhaling this pink light in the heart space. Glowing a little more with every breath. We're gonna move through this short flow with this beautiful pink light glowing in your chest, within your body, within your heart space. And every time we inhale within any position today, you're gonna to imagine this light glowing just a little more. in your own time, finding yourself with your eyes open. We're gonna begin by finding ourselves in child's pose. So we're gonna have our knees extended to each side, so to the edges of the mat. Feet, toes are gonna come together, the big toes are gonna come together. We're gonna stretch our buttocks back down to the mat, stretching forward with the hands, resting down here with the head, the forehead on the mat. And I want you to go back into that breath, into the heart space, into that light. Stretching out the back, stretching through. Exhaling, surrendering to the love. Inhaling the pink light into the heart. On the next inhale, coming up, pushing up, down into downward dog. Finding yourself with your 
toes pressing into the earth. Maybe this is the first downward dog of your day, pressing in through all fingers, lifting up the buttocks to the ceiling, to the sky, pressing down through the arms, shoulders away from the ears. Allowing your feet to sink a little further in. Look through the arms, come through into downward dog. So downward dog, we're gonna have our feet stretched back, toes are rooted onto the floor, hips are lifted up off the earth, feet, the weight goes back into the hips, so like we're pushing down the sacrum into the floor, lifting up the head, shoulders away from the ears, into the back here, so the shoulder blades are coming together, you're finding that space in the back here, breathing in, exhaling, coming back, knees down, resting down, coming down into child's pose once more. Finding yourself in child's pose. Forehead massaged on the mat. And in your own time, coming into plank pose. And then just allowing yourself with your hands underneath your shoulders, Knees underneath the hips here, feet flat. We're going to inhale to bend and arch the back. Cat cow, exhale. Inhaling, looking up, heart opening. Exhale, cat cow. One more, inhaling, cat cowing. And now you're going to come back into downward dog, finding yourself stretching again, pushing down in through the fingers, shoulders away from the ears, lifting the hips up to the sky. And then coming back down into plank pose here. This time what we're going to do is we're going to find ourselves in cobra. So you're going to have your feet and toes are going to be pressing. So even the pinky toe, all the toes are going to be pressing down into the earth. And we're going to find ourselves with our hands underneath our shoulders, hips resting down, heads resting down onto the earth here. So we're going to be fully resting down. You're going to find yourself just breathing for a moment. So you're going to have your hands underneath your shoulders. Hips are placed down on the earth, rooting down through the toes. You're going to breathe in, you're going to look forward. We're going to find ourselves with our elbows reaching into our bodies. We're going to be lifting the crown, stretching the neck, keeping the neck straight. Look forward, finding that spaciousness in the back. Hands are firmly planted. Sacrum is pushing down, back down as if it's pointing into the earth. Tailbone tucked under, engaging those um, the thighs, the knees are automatically going to be away from the earth because you're pushing down through the toes. Inhaling, exhaling, oh, resting down. It feels so good. And just one more time now that the technique is there. Breathing in, looking through, stretching back. Opening up the heart space, exhaling, inhaling, 
Exhaling down, just knowing if it's too much on the spine that you can come down at any time. Push up through the hands, come back down into child's pose. Wide-legged child's pose. And just feeling into the lower back here and into the upper back. Stretching down into the earth. Surrendering down. Allowing yourself to stretch into your back, to breathe into your back. Inhaling, coming up into bow pose now. So we're going to again surrender into the earth, finding ourselves surrendering right down. Head's going to come resting on the mat. Hands are going to be underneath the shoulders. And what we're going to do is we're going to be lifting up through again. So the same actions again. And we're going to be allowing ourselves to grip onto. Now you can either grip onto the tops of your toes or you can grip onto your ankles here. So I'm going to find myself gripping onto my ankles because I find it less intense. And then you're going to be breathing in and finding yourself again lifted up away from the mat, but your chest is going to be lifted higher. So you're going to be again keeping the neck straight. You're going to be again keeping the elbows into the body and just finding yourself with your heart opening. Just one last back bending pose today. So in your own time, inhaling, lifting up, grabbing on, making space, lifting up through in through the neck, keeping it straight, looking up. This is really intense on the back, so if it's too much, come out any time. Exhaling. Inhaling. Exhaling, coming down. And coming back into child's pose. The final child's pose. Really feeling into that counter pose here. Breathing in, that pink light into the heart space, just one more time. Exhaling, surrendering to Mother Earth, allowing her to hold you in her love. At the very least, we know that Mother Earth gives us her love and constant support. When we're finding it tough to come from ourselves, we know it can come from her. And on the next inhale, coming out of child's pose, finding yourself back seated onto the mat. <sighs> Eyes closed. Knowing that that pink light is always there in your heart space whenever you need. Let's just take a couple of deeper breaths, cleansing breaths, inhaling, heart to belly, exhaling, <sighs> that feels great, inhaling, <sighs> and maybe just one more together. <sighs> Thank you so much. Loving you. Namaste.